Hello, welcome to a video where we will talk uh, how to get uh, offline installers for the original Baldur's Gate 2 and how to do download the game outside of uh, GOG client and also if you don't have that option how to get legal copy of Baldur's Gate 2 original of GOG in the year 2023. So now first option with the offline installers you go to gog.com you will have to create the, an account I already have one so sign in and you hover over your account and go to games and click. Now scroll where you have that. So it has a Baldur's Gate 2 complete. In here, you download the offline backup game installer. So click on that and get uh, one, two, Three and it will wait till the download is complete. And meanwhile, talk about what if you don't have this option? What what if there are only here you know, without original, without means of getting the original? Well, there's still an option. So you go to store, GOG store, and find the Baldur's Gate page so here we have it Baldur's Gate to Enhance Edition and here in the description you can read that uh, this Enhanced Edition includes the classic Baldur's Gate to complete so how to obtain that you well it's still very similar well I'm not going to buy that but it should be very similar you would go to your games again, then click on the Baldur's Gate 2, and there should be an option here in more, and you should select here serial keys, and then you follow the link that's provided there. And there should be a link to download the original version. So that's how you would get a copy of a legal copy in 2023 of the original Baldur's Gate 2. So and it's confirmed to to work. It should be very similar to what have we just done in this video, and. Uh, so don't despair there's still it's very obscure way how to get it uh, not exactly clear to me why but uh, apparently there's a way i don't know of any other site where you can do it except for gog it does not work on a steam version so now we wait till the download of Offline uh, backup installers is done. So once that's all done, you go to your download location folder, click on this uh, this uh, orange icon, and we will install it wherever you want to press accept and install now why would you want to install or to get the offline backup well if you ever get yourself in the situation where there's no internet or you just want to mod your game and experiment then then you will appreciate having option to install several copies at once because if you only get it from GOG the client, I believe it only gives you option to have one 
copy installed at the same time. So I hope the, this video helped you even if you don't have, if you have to buy it uh, bundled with Baldur's Gate 2 Enhanced Edition. Also, there should be a way how to get original Baldur's Gate 1, uh, which unfortunately basically vaporized of the face of the internet for whatever reason. And if you use the analogical steps for Baldur's Gate 1 Enhanced Edition of GOG, you should be able to get the absolute original, which is quite different from what they offer. So, without further ado, let's launch the game. All right, and now I want to show you, if you want to mod, how to know which version of Baldur's Gate you are running. That's why we are using the TOB. Now you click on this icon with, a, with this uh, artifact, and here you have the version number. So 26498 is the latest version. All the mods are basically configured around the last, last official patch. So if you're installing from CD or something like that, you need to in get somewhere the patch two six four nine eight before you beginning begin uh, in the modding. So I hope to I will. By the way, I will try to put together some modding configurations where you can get some inspiration how to replay your favorite RPG and hope to see you in those videos and also thanks for watching and bye